the first thing I'm going to head is to is basically both uh, the, the lower lot of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre and the Exorcist. Each of these are at least a 40 minute, a 50 minute ride, you know. Oh wait, wait, I'm sorry. So, that's, let's see, hope for the best, okay? So can't wait to, can't wait to show you guys. And for those who have not been here before, there's an aerial view of the top thing of the night. Or technically, that you can pay to see the outside of LA. It's very beautiful here, especially if you're going out with someone, you know, especially with a significant other. Okay, here we go. Nine minute wait. Let's go. Let's do this. Oh, seven minutes. Seven minutes wait. That's a good thing. Okay, so as you see it, look at this line right here. Seven minute wait. All the fun and joy of not spending over a hundred, two hundred dollars on on the flight pass. social distancing. Why? It's because that you see that you enter into the Halloween Horror Night, you need to have, as you can see, no social distancing. Why? It's because that you see that you enter into the Halloween Horror Night, you need to have be vaccinated or have a negative COVID test within 72 hours by the time you come here. Since this is a Thursday, that you must be vaccinated on Sunday, I believe. Or Monday. Was, um, yeah, Monday. Yeah, my bad. We're on the whole stretch. Here we go.
process waiting for like at least 55 minutes okay i have to say compared to the last time i saw this it's really worth it so you love the exorcist movie then you will love the base right here I just got out of the uh, of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre maze. It was supposed to be a 15 minute wait, but it actually was only like a 40 minute wait. So that's so that's very good. Okay, so like uh, the same thing as was in 2019, I believe. Like where it where it where it, in, it introduces the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I remember the wait time was like over like an hour for that maze. But wow, look at that. Okay, you see that it still holds up, you know. And then, Okay, as you can see, we have entered Springfield, okay? If you're a fan of the show, we have the classic Krusty Land right here, okay? We have the infamous Quickie Mart right here. And the Aztec Theater will have the Itch and Scratchy movie, you know? Okay? And we have Dr. Nixon, Riviera. Blues right here. Okay, for you Harry Potter fans, okay. On to what you're seeing right now is actually that the 
is actually part of the Harry Potter, okay? So, like, unfortunately, that's some of these areas, especially the Harry Potter thing, is only open to Universal Studios Hollywood. You know, you want to experience the full thing, okay? So, like, uh, well, guess not. For any fans of Halloween Horror Nights, you all remember down this pathway. The long pathway. The most dreadful pathway ever, okay? Oh, what line is this for? Okay guys, so just to have a quick update It's been like over 2 hours and 30 minutes since I arrived to Halloween Horror Nights And I've already completed only 2 mazes And considering, considering that since I'm the only one here That, I say that's pretty kind of good Basically that if you go here with a, with a, with a bunch of guys, okay uh, With no bathroom break If you're not gonna, if you're not gonna do Everything, including the no terror tram or no rise like the mummy or go on the lost world or the most famous transformers uh, You can hit all the mazes by hopefully by 2 a.m. How much are the churls? How much do they need? Yeah, how much are the churls? I don't know. What? Something like seven. So, well, how much are the churls? Six. He got them. He just doesn't pay attention to pricing. I think it was guys I have just uh, finished from the haunting of the hill from Nef of Netflix okay it's only an hour and 30 minutes wait okay so I have to say that it's kind of like worth it you know because like just like the, the American Horror Story like last year last time okay so like uh, I'm very excited to see it on Netflix okay okay next is the curse of Pandora's box
okay, 35 minutes of wait. Okay, so let's do this. Pandora, the curse of Pandora's box maze. It's only a five minute wait. It's supposed to be a 35 minute wait. Okay, so that's very good, okay? So, yeah. Overall, if, if, we're, if, we're, if we're not going for all the, the, vis the, visual, the visual things, you know, then uh, I would have to say, I would have to say that it's kind of okay, you know? Yeah. Okay, I have one more maze to go, and that is the Curse of Michael Myers Halloween 4, okay? And then, then, then that's that, is on to the gift shop. The estimated wait time is supposed to be at least like 30 minutes, okay? So, okay, we're finally on the home stretch, and I, ha and I can't believe how I I'm saying this, that no bathroom break, it is possible to do all the mazes, as long as you don't go to a show, or, or a ride. Okay, we'll see you then. Now, actually, the ride effect is only 10 minutes. The Walking Dead attraction is only 30 minutes. Okay, so let's do this, okay?
Okay, well, I just got out of the Walking Dead attraction, okay? It takes place inside the jail house, and basically there's a bunch of walkers right there, and basically some very good cosplays and all, all that stuff, you know? And also very cute, scary scenes. So it is an attraction, so basically you love The Walking Dead, so you love the attraction, okay? So next thing is that we're gonna go into one of the shortest waits of time, is The Bride of Frankenstein. I just got back from the Bride of Frankenstein. It so far it is the shortest maze I have been to. 15 minutes to be exact. So above all that you love Frankenstein, I say it's kind of good. Especially that ending. 
Oh my god, that ending of that maze is so good. Okay, so I'm at the final stretch. I have one more maze to go, which is Halloween 4, the return of Michael Myers. Okay, okay, and we'll finally end this of Halloween Horror Night of 2021. Okay, there you go. Okay, 30 minutes, final stretch, and then we're all done. And then after that, head to the gift shop and then go home. guys that was a wrap okay i just got out of the michael myers thing okay it was a, it was a 30 minute wait okay but it felt like less than that okay so overall it was very good okay so above all that i had a very great time experience okay so it's time to head to the good shop and then it's time to head home <laughs>